Have you ever wondered what the longer-term view of the labor industry will be like by 2050? We are gifted by answers. In this video today, we bring you the expert's prediction on what the longer term of labor is going to be like by, say, 2050. Hey guys, welcome to another exciting video from our channel. Before we dive into the details, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more such videos and updates. That said, let's begin. The future world labor in 2050 is bleak, said the experts. The working world is going to be a really different place than how it is today. If you're unlucky enough to not have retired by then, the vision of the longer term for workers tend to gauge from a nihilistic view of the robots taking our jobs. Robot Assistant In 2050, technology will dominate the planet, with AI and smart sidekicks being commonplace. While the application of stoked and computer games continues to extend, everything is going to be smart, connected, and data-driven. The inviting maturity folks will continue working in an original way or moment, but the places and offer are going to be bones that have not yet been constructed. Emotional intelligence and mortal chops like perpetual literacy are going to be pivotal for leaders to retain, also as ignorance with the newest technologies. Work will increasingly become more fluid as some workers are going to be virtual. Some are going to be full-time, some are going to be bought, and that we will each be working on fixed hours. Like any relative change, there will be pros and cons. Those that add routine jobs are likely to struggle to form. Sure, they'll stay applicable within the new world of labor. Space Passages Space passages designed to shoot people to Mars could start passing in 2030. In spaceflight, the thing of the Earth is to prompt to Mars. We've been to the moon constantly, but no major plans to measure there. Mars appears as a posterior big deal. Elon Musk's space company SpaceX and Jeff Bezos' company Origin are working lifelessly to prompt us to Mars. Smartphones Pearson said by 2025, smartphones are going to be rendered obsolete because of advancements in stoked reality. However, people will tease you, he said, if it's 2025 and you've got a smartphone, it'll be possible to haul up defenses in AR via a small cuff or other piece of jewelry within the coming 10 times, making it gratuitous to hold around a smartphone. Companies like Magic Leap are working to bring AR into the mainstream. Though smartphones are getting smarter day by day, but within the future, you'll have access to your phone and further by commodity differently like hologram. Transportation Whether that comes within the kind of an auto is up for debate. Pearson said transportation revolution. In 2014, over-electric vehicles were registered around the world. In 2019, a rise to 2.3 million vehicles. By 2025, EV deals are projected to surpass 10 million. By 2025, the bulk of motor cars are going to be electric, performing to dwindling need for gas stations but rather charging stations. Driverless buses are going to be the norm like Tesla driverless buses. Computers Ian Pearson said advancements in nanotechnology will make it possible to plug our smarts into computers and sleep in a simulated world. You can clearly make commodities, a touch just like the Matrix, if you wanted to, Pearson told Tech Insider. Around 2045-2050, you will link people smart to the computers so much that they believe they're living in a virtual world. Pearson said the conception may be a bit like what Tesla CEO Elon Musk outlined when he talked about Neural Lace at the Vox Media's Code Conference in Southern California. Neural Lace may be a wireless brain computer system that might add a digital subcase of intelligence to a brain. It's a concept nanotechnologists are performing. People could also come to cyborgs by 2045 Shutterstock. Still, also we could use analogous technology to show people into part machine, part human. We will link people's smarts to computers by 2045. Personal Assistants Personal assistants have developed throughout the 21st century. First of all, they might only answer primitive questions in 2019, and the voiceovers were as dumb as a jewel box. But by 2025, they've learned the art of fitting and writing speech, also with punctuation. They may understand the meaning of a textbook and really read it so that it's almost indistinguishable from a person's book. This resulted in the automation of half of all office air conditioners. They began swinging writing post-meeting reports, summarizing lengthy documents, and internationally digesting and extracting the contents of the letters. They also plan your day, schedule meetings, and actually order lunch. Ocean thermal energy can take us to 100 renewable energy. Ocean thermal energy still remains a largely untapped resource and one among the world's largest renewable energy sources. Blue Rice Company is performing on creating an energy advance by generating mileage-scale electricity through ocean thermal energy conversion. 
it will be ready to outcompete current energy grounded generation and other renewables that need storehouse and grid balancing. It will play an important part within the unborn energy, blend being one among the only many constant energy sources available day and night time round. What do you think of the future technology? Do you think the world will turn into a better place or the worst? Share with us your ideas by dropping your comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more. See you in the next one.